So what is training volume and how do you know if you're doing too much? So volume is basically the amount of training you do in a given workout and it's a combination of your sets, reps, and weight of each exercise. But for simplicity of this video, I'm just gonna talk about sets. Now, in order to elicit hypertrophy or muscle growth, you need to be doing enough working sets or sets done close to failure in order to signal your body to get stronger. And this is known as the minimum effective volume or the least you have to do in the gym to continue building muscle. And this differs for everyone based on genetics and lifestyle factors. And it also differs for every muscle group. But as a general, guideline, somewhere around 6 to 10 sets per muscle group per week is usually going to be enough to stimulate growth. However, since this is the minimum requirement, it does potentially leave gains on the table, but it drastically reduces the risk of injury and the buildup of fatigue over time. Now, on the other hand, every muscle also has what's called a maximum recoverable volume, which as it sounds, is the most volume you can do before a muscle can no longer recover from it. So for most people, this is usually around 20 to 25 working sets per week, and going anywhere close to that upper limit, or even slightly beyond that, is called over reaching, and doing this for a prolonged period of time is what leads to overtraining, chronic fatigue, plateaus, and potentially even muscle loss. So if training at high volume could actually lose you gains, why do people do it? Well, the idea here is that even though training at a higher volume will create more fatigue, it also will allow you to progress slightly faster for a short time after you give your body a longer time to recover. And doing this is called functionally overreaching, where you are doing more on purpose, usually in the last two to three weeks of a six to eight week training cycle, then incorporating a deload week to dissipate your body's overall fatigue and be able to start again stronger. Now, if this sounds confusing or you're just not interested in doing that, then I'd recommend just training in a set range of around 10 to 20 per week, starting on the low end in the beginning of your training cycle and working up higher towards the end. In terms of how to tell if you're doing too much, first, ask yourself, how do you feel in the gym? If you're tired, unmotivated, not progressing, potentially regressing, and you just feel weak and down in general, then chances are you are doing more than you are capable of recovering from. And in that case, take a look at your training routine and see how many sets you're doing. If it's towards the high end, maybe start a deload and drop it down closer to the 10 to 15 range. And if it's not towards the high end, take a look at your recovery. Are you sleeping well, eating well, are you stressed and improve what you're doing outside the gym and go from there. And if you are training at a high volume and you have been for a while, but you are still progressing and you feel perfectly fine in the gym, then your body is most likely capable of handling that. But if you're not progressing and you also don't feel super fatigued, chances are you're just not training hard enough. So instead of just adding more sets to what you're already doing, try making those sets that you are doing as difficult as possible to get the most benefit out of them. But that should answer your question and I hope that helps.